three failed runaways. I haven't even left ACDC one. It's no pirate curse the run. Guaranteed. Your sports ball nom knowledge is very limited. I have like a very decent understanding of pretty much every sport. But I don't follow them too tightly anymore. Why follow sports when you can just play video games? Besides, most of my teams are usually like Honestly, not the greatest. Uh, it was really hype back in 04 and 07 when the Red Sox won the World Series, and I was a Red Sox fan. Um, the Dolphins have never been particularly good. The Celtics have always been like decent, and they were usually they used to be really good. So because of that, like I don't know. After a certain point, like around middle high school, I just stopped getting really hyped for sports. At least watching them. You cursed the run, Snow Pirate. I had the absolute worst runaway luck I've ever seen. Uh, so this is not as fast as the last run, but. Still, be, still decent, I guess. All the sports, you can understand what the hell your coworkers are talking about. <laughs> I don't think any of my coworkers follow any sports. I'll be perfectly honest with you. It's such a shame that you can get the 400s any there, and it still might not be the frame. <gasps> oh my god. Well, that's a guaranteed guard. Well, no, that's good. And I got the frame, okay. There it is. Beautiful. Hopefully, looks like I'll only get two encounters in this area. Looking good. Come on, game! Like, why? Why am I failing every 75% run rate today? Are you fucking kidding me? I just want a good run where I get... Please don't. Please at least don't give me the third encounter. Okay. I'll accept that. Jesus Christ. Uh, I think the last one. Oh. I, I cannot believe this right now. I think the bug frag is over by the shop. If I can get to the shop before this second encounter, but that would never happen, of course. This is going to be in the third failed runaway. Oh, thank God. At least one out of three with a 75% run chance, by the way. This last one's a bug frag. All right. Probably going to get a third encounter, which really sucks. Yep. No, yeah, I hit the frame. I hit the perfect frame. Well, not the perfect frame, but the frame I'm aiming for. Which is why I'm so mad that I got two failed runaways. One, I might have been like, eh, you know, it's fine. No, yeah, I have 950 Zenny. I have enough Zenny for the sneak runs. No, yeah, I'm, I'm like, I wouldn't have been that mad with one. The reason that I'm so mad is that today I have gotten, like, every failed runaway possible, it feels like. 
Mm, no, we usually get four. But that's expected. To get one at that point. But also, to be fair, I took one of those fights. You can get through both areas with getting two encounters each time. So, total of four. But you, it's anywhere from four to six. He and his XCOM has met XCOM and they shared notes. <laughs> Curse thrown by being here. Don't worry, Snowfire. We're gonna make it through this. Yeah. You can get to an ACDC too. I've had it happen many times. Playing the VGC has taught you anything. It's that anything that has a ha chance to happen will happen 50% of the time if you are scared of it happening. Uh, if this game has taught me anything, it's that if I expect something to happen, it won't happen. And it's down to RNG. And that's not just this game, that's BN in general. So far... I mean, I guess the only thing that could have gone wrong so far was the first trip through ACDC 1, which still had two failed runaways. But we get all three sneak runs. Hopefully, we can just get through this. We already have a guard 1A, which, like, may not be necessary, but... Oh, hey, I can buy four sneak runs. Which means I can use one early. On the next trip. Okay, we're at two bug frags. I'm liking it. I'm liking this a lot better than my, most of my runs. Okay, okay. So far, that's the only useless GMD I've gotten. But that one's not even guaranteed to spawn in a pickable location. Sick. Got the second one. Let's go. <laughs> And now the only RNG left in the run, well, in this split, in terms of time, at least, is, do I get a good draw on Colonel? Do I draw swords? Sick.
with a mod type of thing. I'm sure you could do that with a mod. I, I don't know how it would be done. I'm not an expert on modding GBA games, but... Uh, okay, my Zenny's looking really good right now. I, I haven't been keeping track of my Zenny number. Um, I will check when I see... when I have to use my next sneak run. Which is next area. Only HP affects runaway chance, right? Not reg ups? Yes, that is correct. Reg ups don't affect runaway chance, just my HP value after BN. Starting with BN3. Before that, power ups also affected it, but. My sneak run will expire now ish. My movement was actually so good <laughs> that my encounter, or my, my sneak run expired way later than even I expected. What changed? Uh, Lucky got world record on US, and it's even faster than the supposed theorize, or, or the, the run of JP that uh, has been talked about but has never been seen. So. Uh, also, basically, I was getting frustrated with the JP version anyway. So it just convinced me that I think the US version is faster. Uh, I could definitely be wrong about that, but this one's definitely way easier to grind as well. Phenomenal movement. And so, area 2 is kind of useless. Didn't get any bug frags, I'm still at 2. But 2 is actually pretty good at this point in the run, I would say. Better than what I normally average. Good draw means this is a sub 14 kernel, actually. Uh, this could still actually be a good draw. I just need to draw swords in the next two slots as well. Which is actually pretty likely. Oh, what the fuck? Alright, I just need one more counter hit. I don't need a counter anymore. That's unfortunate. Fifty fifty, by the way. <laughs> yeah. To be fair, things that we think are 50-50s might not actually be. For example, Dive Man is actually like a 33% chance to attack. So technically speaking, his movement pattern could be less likely to come to the front, and we just don't know it. <laughs> uh, my splits on the left are comparing against Lurking's Ooh. Uh. So we go here. I have enough Zenny that I can just buy 
all four that are necessary for the next split. And then I only need 500 zenny more, I guess, for mine key. That's basically all that's left. Sick. Stream in your time zone. Yes, up, Johnny. Speedrunner gets a lot of HP early on. It's not where you can have that much HP until you start watching. No, yeah, it gets like every HP memory basically possible. <sighs> Damn it, dude. I could have even gotten a sub 14 or sub 14 kernel still. But we're up to three bug frags before live one. I like it. I like it a lot. Ho ho ho, look at that draw. That's what I like to see. Usually have 140 going into Blizzard Man. That's fair. For a casual, that's actually pretty good. It's really funny though, because you like basically keep up your HP amount with uh Colonel. Let's see here. I think if you're not on the road. You area grab, he would move forward more frequently. If you move out of the front row, area grab can expire. If the fight ends up taking too long. Also, it's kind of hard to move into the panel to counter hit him with normal swords if you're not already in the front row. I think this is actually a one turn draw. Not quite. Oh, I used the chip instead of releasing my buster. <laughs> Oops. Hit an enemy with it in a solo battle. Indeed. Indeed. Liberation missions? Yo, what's up, Fred? I like these. They're actually really fun for the speedrun. Like, they're easily my favorite part of the run. Copy damage in a net battle tournament just to flex, hell yeah. But the 50-50 probably changes with area steel. It probably it might. I, I I don't think it would, considering he doesn't even have rules about moving into your row, but. Oh god, okay. Let's be a little more patient. How could you like liberation missions better than running drill three three times? <laughs> Last. <laughs> god damn it. Oh man. Alright, alright. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. No, I didn't want to take that. 
That guy can't. Oh my god. Fifty fifty, by the way. I lost two fifty fifties in a row for him to come to the front. Um, let's see what I can do here. That's unfortunate. I'm gonna move down, actually. Get hit. Oh my. Dude. This guy. I'm trying to figure out, like, more optimal strats with Colonel's C Cannon on these two Dark Holes, but... Haven't been getting... I got good results on the first one. The second one is a bit trickier, because... You might be surrounded. Technically, you might be surrounded on the first. No. Even if you're. S I was surrounded. It doesn't matter if you're surrounded on the first one. The second one's just a bit weird. Here. So. I don't know if that was necessary, considering he might just. Like, he would attack. Still, but. Not sure exactly what's faster, waiting or. Very grabbing. I would assume waiting could be faster. Mm hmm. Stupid fight, man. I went for the counter hit with Vulcan, which is actually just dumb. You can't. Getting the counter hit with Vulcan actually sucks. Wide Sword's the best chip. See how much easier that was? I know he had less health, but Wide Sword is just so much easier to counter with. Fun fact, Lurking, um, you really need to improve your live one. Just saying. <laughs> I think you must have also failed the Blizzard Man fight. I think you had to have. There's no way. Pretty sure you reset if you fail Blizzman? I would believe it. I want to reset, but... Everything else about this run is too good. You're gonna actually go check your run? It's possible that you were like, oh, I got a sub-14 kernel. It doesn't matter that I failed Blizzard Man once. Oh, I need to... Because technically speaking, that's my thought process right now, is that... My kernel was good enough that I don't need to worry about... So, I still need 500 zenny for mine key, but I already have all my sneaker in, so I don't even need to make the shopping trip. 100 zenny short? We're looking pretty good. No, we watched Lucky's run yesterday. Four bug frags, all right. Lucky it also plays Proto Man, whereas Lurking plays Colonel. 
Oh wait, that means I have regular Blizzard Man, not Blizzard Man SP. Oh god. Well, at least I'm good on Zenny. Oh no. I didn't think this one through. It's a shame though, because the run works. It's not bad, but now I have to keep that in mind that it's 30 damage less. Ugh. Yo, what's up, fat kid? Only starts making a difference. I know it only makes a difference later in the run when you can draw better things anyway. It's Fat Kid vote him. Fat Kid is the best imposter. I swear. I'm pretty confident you get standard Blizzard Man. If you don't one phase him there, um, I don't need the Zenny really. Uh, I could still use it, but I'm gonna skip that GMD anyway. The other GMD location is really far out of the way, basically, guarantees that you get a third encounter in this area. Uh, so it actually does lose a significant amount of time. And it's basically impossible to get a bug frag from the other spawn due to a bug. RNG bug. I was pretty good too when her partner isn't voted out round one. Yeah, well, I got the third encounter anyway, and then failed the runaway, so. keepers she's super aggressive good we've taught her well <laughs> might have learned it when her first game is imposter I tried to get her to do a double kill immediately and she got caught <laughs> she couldn't find the kill button she's also probably that's just probably how she plays games honestly so I think Among Us is the only game I've played with Io so far so You said almost every fight be a two turn. Understandable. Yeah, I caught killing me because of the misclick. <laughs> I had some really good imposter rounds yesterday, and I had that one insanely good round yesterday where I had the biggest freaking brain. And I also, th my favorite round was the round where Fat Kid and I were imposter. Like, holy shit, Fat Kid's just a legend. We don't need Dark Sword at the top yet. Or in the top five yet. So you can leave it in slot one. It's perfectly fine. One of the funniest imposter runs you've had. Yeah. I was pretty confident it was Dallas. Um, I had no idea it was lurking until 
that five round that there was five people left. Forced fight's gonna go today. I have regular blizzard. Oh fuck. No! And the copy damage right now? Wait, did I miss copy damage? What did I just do? I'm gonna set up for swords. Man, I thought copy damage should last longer than that. Weird. I accidentally moved back up once. I should have just taken the hits and been like, whatever. Damn it. Pretty mediocre fights overall, but hey, we got a win star. Guess we're playing BN3 today. Look at that. Four bug frags, which is more than I normally have at this point. I'll be perfectly honest with you. Starting off strong. Oh, wait. That's what we're supposed to do. I'm setting that up because that's more important. I, I missorted because my old notes would have told me to reverse MB sort. I was misremembering. They get three encounters in this comp, so I think this actually kind of sucks. Didn't even see a single Drixel. That's not good. Still have a lot of chances, but the fact they didn't even see one. Oh, oh boy. 
Drill comp is dumb anyway. I mean, these comps are kind of annoying, but... up a little bit, but that's okay. Easy clap. Oh no. Alright, five bug frags. I finally got a bug frag in drill comps, dude. I'm so excited. What is wrong with me? I should have just moved forward based on the way that I was doing that. I'm just running away. Running away with my shame. I'll take all of this time loss. This is acceptable. Punishment. God, I should have just moved forward. Use the wide sword and step. Ah, what's wrong with me, dude? You, I hate everything, dude. These comps just kill me nowadays. I don't know what it is. When I was, like, learning, I never messed these comps up, and now I just mess them up every time. I don't understand it. Think this works? Okay. I was like, I think this works as I expect it to, but I'm not sure. Oh god, I lost track of where I was. That was close. Three drill arms. Drill comp two is taking way too long. Which makes sense because, you know, I failed to go through the rocks at the worst possible time. It's the worst mistake you can make. Something about drill comp too, dude. Maybe I should practice it, but... The thing is with cycles being random because of the... Oh yeah, I can go. If I see it. The one hit rock. Dude, those were so bad. Jesus. The thing with cycles being slightly random due to the... Um, I'm actually going to run away from this one. I technically could have 50-50'd it, but not really necessary. Five bug breaks, okay. Maybe it would have been worth it to 50-50 it since I'm in the final count. I don't know what the encounters look like in this area. Like, I don't know what the likelihood is of me running into a double Drixel is. When you were a kid playing this, your mind thought, hold on. Alright, so... I guess that works. That's the last drill arm. Um, okay. 
No longer need to take that. Probably could have made that one, but it's fine. Weaving is so easy to me. Everything else about these comps is hard. Well, not everything else. It's just the, like, weaving in a one-off one, one -off situation, I guess is the way I would put it. Am I gonna get an encounter? Aw, I was wondering. Do I get a reward for breaking one of the toughest rocks? I need to say you didn't get a reward for it. <laughs> Feels bad. So, biggest mistakes, I failed drill comp 2, uh, I failed a runaway after failing a fight, so it was technically a 3 turn runaway, it's not good. Um, comp 3 I think went basically perfectly, comp 1 I failed one runaway. Which is like okay, honestly these comps were okay. Decent-ish? I'm still gonna lose time, but that's... Dude. Oh my god. Make it! <laughs> I'm waiting for this cycle. And Oh, that cycle just worked out so nicely. What the heck? I forgot how many bug frags I'm at. I think I said five. I guess we'll see when I do this folder edit. Oh, well, I get six now. Oh, oh, oh. What is this edit? Uh-huh. Something like that. attack. I think this one's just a, uh, Shitty execution so far, normally I have the opposite. Uh, yeah. Honestly, execution-wise, I've made three big mistakes, though. Which, honestly, isn't that bad. And I wouldn't even call it, like, one of them was a really big mistake. That was the Blizzard Man fight. I can argue that's lost me about 35 seconds. The other two big, big mistakes was basically I failed a fight that ended up being a three turn runaway essentially oh I'm at seven bug frags I'm done sick wait I didn't use the sneak run I'm done I was thinking I was too busy focused on the bug frag count my Zinni count is pretty abysmal, but that's okay. I still need to grab GMDs just for Zenny though. Hmm. 
No, yeah, Zenny is pretty abysmal right now. But that's salvageable. Shade Man 5, let this guy die already. Is this a disadvantaged fight? I forget. Yeah. Disadvantage really sucks. Especially given this draw. Jesus Christ. So this just means Shade Man attacks. Honestly, I don't think there was much I could have done with that draw. Unless I like go for a counter hit, but that's tough. Charge shot, counter hit, charge shot, copy damage, full synchro. But now, we're surrounded, well, we're always surrounded for this. Drill arm, thank you. So I messed this fight up a little bit. I'm dumb. But that's fine. I could have one-turned this. There is a very consistent one-turn setup for it. Uh, but... Has a love-hate relationship with the player. True... Dark holes are always the exact same, yes. Oh, I even got that counter hit. Beautiful. Dark holes are always the same. Guardians are obviously always the same because it's just them. <sighs> All right. Sick. Bird killer, you get him. Learn you can use that a bit earlier than I was from watching Lucky's run yesterday, funnily enough. One turn here would be very nice. Not required, but um, I think I have it. Yeah. Hmm. 
I'll attack this guy even though he's 90% immune to my attacks. Yeah. Uh, it doesn't really matter though because Nightman would have blocked it for Mega Man anyway. They were close enough. There's a consistent quick kill or one turn with just the sea cannon, but do 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 do. Yeah. Uh, Blizzard Man might have been slightly faster. Oh no! I ruined everything. Good thing I had Blizzard Man. I feel like my movement has not been fast enough with Nightman for some reason, and I don't know why. That bat, in my most recent runs, has always gone up before I can get there, whereas in the past, he never did. It's really strange. Why was one turning the last fight so important when that fight seemed pretty consistent to one turn? Would have eliminated the previous turn's extra square anyway. Uh, it wouldn't have... The guy would have moved differently. I would have been attacked. The back can sit there for it. Do, I'm pretty sure it can sit there for a random amount of time. So it's either I'm getting stupidly unlucky, or whatever. So basically, one turning with Mega Man two turns ago, right? It gets rid of the extra square, so the brute that just respawned actually does not move forward and attack Mega Man. Saves that animation. That's the only real amount of time save that you get out of that. Um, yeah, yeah, this one's better than using Blizzard Man. Yeah, so like, but the thing is, I've been consistently getting wrecked by the bat, is the thing. That's why I'm so annoyed. So now it doesn't matter if I one turn. That was, like, that had to have been, like, frame perfect or something weird. Because the, the Metar should have gotten knocked back by the drill instead of getting double hit by it. Fight, dude. Where I was, was I not getting drill arms in up? What? I'm not sure what that question means. Yeah. In JP, I see. Uh, no, I was not really focused on getting it in JP because it would save time on this liberation, and that's basically it. Alright. I'm down. That was in what? This liberation was sick. Holy shit! I made like one small mistake. What the fuck? All right, all right. <laughs> I was here. <laughs> The thing is, I have the bug frags now. Um, my Zenny is still looking pretty mediocre, but that shouldn't be a huge problem yet. Time save over Protoman. Time save over Protoman. 
Oh yeah, that Shade Man fight was phenomenal. Okay. There's only two comps in Squirrel comps that you can get encounters in, pretty much. The others is like a single encounter check, probably at 3%, and it's like super unlikely. So only when you move right. So in the first comp and in this comp, are you really able to get encounters. In the US version, specifically. Alright. Now I have to debate. I don't need to get a lock enemy, right? I legit just don't need to get one. I was gonna say, it's literally in my splits, Mike. Codes. All right, there we go. I'm back. Hold on. Let me just check in and I'll catch up on stuff. Chaotic, thank you for the raid, my friend. That was your Star Force 2 finale, I assume, of your Star Force marathon. Absolute number trader focus. Yeah, I was not losing focus at all. Not a chance in the world I was losing focus there. Thank you for the good luck, Dr. Tony. I should have bought him a fourth, but it's too late for that. Back. Finally get to play Star Force 3. Hell yeah. 500 fights incoming. Let's go. Yo, what's up, heal? <laughs> oh, hey, we're done on bug frags completely. Let's go. It's a shame my Zenny sucks so much. I'll check these GMDs. I don't like checking them, but... Alright, like... The fact that I'm getting Zenny from them is so worthwhile. Do I have enough for the HP memory? I hope the answer is yes. I didn't use a sneak run. Or I didn't use my I didn't do my full rate. My sneak run should expire, I was gonna say. Uh what do I do here? Two Cluster up. And then we Is that the sword I do? God damn it. I have to practice my folder edits a bit more. 500 man challenge when? Uh, in a little bit. 
<laughs> Rip his HP number. Uh, I'm curious if JP with drill arms and using direct glitch with different ships instead of guardians to avoid this any issue, but if you have enough, obviously, to get it, obviously get it would be worth it. Um, the only other ship that's really worth direct glitching on a consistent basis is like Django, and Django has a really slow animation. Uh, and starting in later liberations, it ends up being actually really weak. Uh, the liberations, I honestly don't think you really get that much speed up from. Red glitch. Oh, I didn't do the Navi Gust edit. That's a good call. The problem is, is that JP loses so much time just due to extra maps and stuff. If it moves down, this will be good. I was gonna say. I only know to do that, fun fact, because I watched Lucky's run yesterday and that's what happened to him. I didn't realize that the guy could move up first and it would be impacted so heavily. But, there we go. Learning from watching world record, always a good idea. I should have grabbed the other Orin one each for GMD. It's actually way more likely to be Zenny. Oh wait, I need to buy this. Please tell me I have enough. Okay. I need four sneak runs, so I'm 300 Zenny short right now uh, for drill comps. I'll check these GMDs. Ah, shit. Say cluster bug. Say cluster bug. <laughs> This is why you don't want to check these. It's still 100% run rate, but you just lose so much time if you get to like 1 in 8 or 2 in 8. Feels bad, man. This one just, nah, it's not even the one that's in the way. So we have enough Zenny for this next set of sneak runs. We're like barely making it past on Zenny right now. Why was the soul turn put into the Navicust? For a motion bug. You'll see it a bit more later. You'll see exactly why. Basically, starting with Shadow Man. But yeah, because it's bugged right now, it's right next to a yellow program. And it's on the command line, actually. Uh, I have a motion bug. More beneficial than harmful. True. Gotta go dinner. Thank you for the good luck last. Have a great one, my friend. Sick. Uh, 200 Zenny won't be the worst thing, though. I was hoping for the Zenny drop. 
from the BGMD, that would have probably saved me. No, yeah, that, that, that was just troll. Now I'm at 10 bug frags. It's, it's great. Uh, 10. 10 bug frags. Just, you know, barely scraping by on Zenny. Like, I literally got enough Zenny for the sneak runs I'm about to buy in Orin Area 3. I didn't even want to check Orin Area 3 H uh, bug frat, or GMDs, but I had to because otherwise I was not going to have enough Zenny. Uh, I'll check this. Even though it's going to basically guarantee me an encounter, like... Thank God. Nope, I am not getting Dark White, especially not this run. I've been considering it, but... Alright, there we go. Yeah, I really don't want to get another encounter um, by checking GMDs. Remembering how to do this. Damn it, not for sure. Personally, like Dark Drill? Oh, yeah, I'll be getting Dark Drill 100%. Dark White is better for random virus but battles, though. Damn it. Yeah, no, no, no. Yeah, no, Dark Drill's insanely strong. Oh, I forgot that that one's eight text boxes on the US. <laughs> I went to sleep first, right? We're gonna find out if I just killed my run. Okay. I shouldn't have L buttoned because that's pussy strats. I should have been a man. I should have gone all the way up here and then pressed that damn reset button when I fucked up. Remind me to never listen to Lucky again when it comes to L button strats. Yeah, I thought I forgot to sleep because I've done it before relatively recently. Not in a run. Uh, I think I did it when I was setting up my save states. I still need Zenny because I'm at 800. I need 1500 for the uh, sneak runs. I still get a thousand. After this point, I need five more sneak runs. Technically, only four more if I stop checking GMDs, right? So, thinking about that, right? So, I'm still 400 Zenny short ish, I think for those two GMDs, or for, for those two sneak runs. However, uh, afterwards I get a thousand Zenny, which I still need enough for, oh, you know. Yeah. Get a thousand Zenny, two, 400 of that gets added because the other two go to sneak runs. Which means that I need 2,600 still. Which means I need 2,700 more Zenny. To be able to buy a Dark Drill. From random sources. 
I've already accounted for. I know about the 2400 in Live 4. How does that work though if you... Because you can do the fight with Shadow Man when he passes instead, but does that end up baiting the Brute properly? Sick. You need to wide sword. You still have enough order points? Alright, I'll trust you. I'm gonna check drill comp GMDs at least. Um, I will stop grabbing them. Oh, wait, no, because I still need the. That's the thing. I still need 100 Zenny at least for the. Um, God dang it. The sneak hunts. <laughs> I am struggling on Zenny right now. This is a first for US for me. I am struggling. I don't have enough for the, even four sneak runs. Ask Bale for some money, maybe he helps you out. <laughs> Doubt. Sell my dark chips. Oh wait, what am I doing? That was a mistake. Maybe Dark Sword wasn't worth it. Given how early that happened... Alright, we got the sneak runs at least. Always panicking over something, I know, right? I don't actually know the optimal time to use the sneak runs, but we'll see how it goes. It's somewhere there. <laughs> I only did it because it was on a turn frame. <laughs> Dead serious. Lockers for um, expand memory. Yeah, so if you don't go for any GMDs and you just have optimal movement. You can get away with four, because you don't need three on this trip. The whole internet is the dungeon level? Yep. Oh wait, that was bad movement. That introduces extra horizontal movement. God damn it.
Was that like way too early that that expired? I mean, Lucky didn't even cut out horizontal movement in his were. I didn't want to call it out every single time because I was going to become a broken record, but... <laughs> Where? I can think of like end area when you're on your way to uh, the cutscene trigger as Colonel. both times, honestly. Oh yeah, look at that. Only need to use those two sneak runs. Easy. Crap. My sneak run should expire soonish. Let's go. Would you even consider taking BGMD fights at this point for the Zenny? I guess so, right? Because it saves time over doing the fight with Shadow Man. For Wide Blade, I would never take Wide Blade. Fuck that shit. Barely hits anything. Can also get long blade. <laughs> Barely hits any. Standard. Life blade PA. I got thunder from these twice, by the way. And an and a virus. I know what it actually is. I know the PA is. <laughs> oh, so I should still have Dark Sword and a. Y'all are pogging and I'm just like, <laughs> what the fuck? I'm never putting that in my goddamn folder. Yo, what's up, Sil? How's it going? Ow. Oh, there's a corner there. Alright, how do I do this fight? Uh, 
I do this liberation? damage something there but whatever saving my anti damages for later I had him for a second, but I didn't trust it. Air shot plus C counter. Yeah, I could have done that. You're not wrong. That would have been faster. Get who I'm supposed to pass with. Lurking, I don't have your notes open. Who am I supposed to pass with here? I know it's two navvies. Mega does it? Okay. Thank you. It's a good thing Shadow Man's passing soon. <laughs> I guess this is normal field. Uh, you probably shouldn't pass this far back, huh? Because this bait, this force is an attack. That's a mistake. Honestly, I'm just kind of winging this one. I don't have. You can also just move more forward. Oh, I guess that probably beats them in a weird way. One turn here is pretty nice. You can move forward, but then you need to do an extra rotation. True. Movement versus passing. Um, 
Who's supposed to do the dark hole behind me? Uh, that's the next liberation. Uh, this was probably a mistake. Whatever, I'm just gonna use it. This liberation is a 1500 zenny fight. You can do. Um, so wait, I assume Colonel is supposed to do that dark hole. Nightman does the next one, right? Colonel does the one that Sh Shadow Man opens up. That was not what I wanted. Okay. Oh, that's okay. At least I got the one chain now. I didn't want to move up. I can't. At that point, I knew that they were going to both line up together soon. I just had to wait. I'm dumb. Just freaking use it. Oh my god. Whatever. Not a one turn. I don't care. Whatever. I messed this up pretty badly. Ah, oh, that was just slow. Luckily. Jeez. I think I'm supposed to, like, copy an image. There's just a better strat that I'm supposed to do. All right. Good draw, which keeps my health up a bit. Do the shade, man. Yeah, no, that would have been okay. No, copy damage does not affect. Uh, yeah, copy damage doesn't work. With copy. copy damage doesn't work with Django. Is what he's saying. I should have known. I should have known better. I gotta be patient. I technically didn't miss the sword. I hit the sword, just not on every target I was aiming for. Perform your job. All right, let's see if I can nail this trick, which is even harder because I am so low with Shadow Man. Oh! Quick one turn doesn't matter. Glancing blow, not a full whip. True. All right, Shadow Man, do your job. And by that, I mean, hopefully I can hit anti-damage like 12 times in a row. I didn't realize I had anti like We're just gonna... No! That's bad! Whatever. End the fight fast. I'm doing it with Nightman. 
I was doing so well with that too. Does this even- it doesn't even do 100 damage. I was hoping for at least something. No, I just mi- There is already something elect elements on the field. Ah, oh, it's given so much more time save. Could have been such a good gold. But we got a run going. I'm pretty confident that just because I got a run going, I can get sub four with this run easily. Access. Why is follower notifications turned on? I appreciate the follow though. I tried to turn them off at some point and they just randomly got re-enabled again. That's the second time this week. But anyway, I appreciate the follow, that Tsukio guy. That's bad. Let's try. Two text boxes when Colonel's trying to use a sneak run. Dumb US version. <laughs> it's honestly one of the dumbest things I've seen. Is it two in Brotom Hand? I honestly don't know. <laughs> you think so? Okay. Oh, missed that barely. Alright, here we go. That's the proper movement. I should not have tried to turn, but anyway. Which means I'm gonna be at thirteen sixty and then go down to seven sixty. Use in drill four. I could, but it doesn't save me anything at this point, right? Like, I still need more Zenny anyway. Let's see if I can hit this. Oh. 
Just need to do that extra fight and then Fifteen hundred Zenny would not save the day here. That's the only reason I do not take that fight. Yeah, I got the two encounter checks and I got it. Feels bad. Why does the sword swap hands in the overworld depending on what direction you're running? <laughs> yeah, laziness. They never line up. For a double hit. Oh, they did! Herk! Oh, that turned me. That is an example of where you can cut out horizontal movement. Damn it. Perfect enough. No, oh, yeah. Trigger extends. <laughs> Both times, by the way. When you're on your way to the Liberation as well. I don't even have enough to buy the sneak runs early. That's kind of funny. Oh. Do I ever try and cut horizontal movement when walking IRL? Uh, I definitely do optimize everything I do in my life, so. Oh, terrible. This way. Oops. Mistakes were made. I haven't practiced this scenario enough to have like 100% optimal movement. Uh, we see the turn frame there. Like that. Oh, too far though. So this is Twitch Prime when you hover over it. Right. Now we have to go over and buy our sneak runs. It still says Twitch Prime, I was gonna say, yeah. Uh, Fuck. I noticed that earlier when someone subbed with Twitch Prime, and I was like, hmm. Counter check. I think you can technically get encounters in here. I could have also grabbed the 400 Zenny in this comp, but it wouldn't have made a difference either. Would have made a difference if it was a bit closer on the Zenny count.
cut out vertical movement. What is wrong with me? There we go. I like how it took this grade schooler to figure out that the reflections work the way they do compared to Colonel, an advanced AI that should have been able to figure this out instantly. Iris would have figured it out. Probably slept through the lecture on how light works. True. No! I was trying to be so tight with my mood. There's no reason to go for that movement there. Everything is ruined! For comp one. You don't get why wired jack can ports aren't obsolete yet? If the boat had a wireless one for their prized possession. At least I'm only gonna get one cycle of being pushed back here and then we wait and then go down. I have to wait this one out. I'm actually gonna wait here. Uh, oh wait, no, I don't have to. I just realized I don't have to wait because that cyclone's gonna spawn, but because I have the, um. Because I just got an encounter on top of it, it didn't matter. Also, planned. This was all planned, by the way. God damn it. This is my super optimal movement for getting 369 HP. Comp 2 movement, though. I'm a big fan. Herc! So this is going to be interesting. I think I was actually a little delayed getting here, but I get to walk through this tornado anyway. Oh wait, no, it just moves really slow. That's what it is, okay. Beautiful cop too. So there's something about like waiting for the cycle or something. Ruined. Everything's ruined. I don't know what to do. Uh, 
I'll grab these real quick. I'll keep my 369 HP. No! I lost it. Rip. Pepe hands. One Herc. Um, I, I still might get a second encounter. So, oh. I guess that's not out of the question yet. Let's go grab this. Oh my god. That's tight. Jeez. I did the wrong sort, I just realized, because Antifire is not in the spot it's supposed to be in. It's in a more optimal spot for the red glitch, but... I don't know why I bothered taking Blizzardman, taking the uh, Seekin is just better. Um. Still golding? What the fuck? What? Someone explain this. Did I forget something like really, really important? My PB was like, you know, a little mis a little bad, but like the what could I have forgotten? Because I definitely grabbed that thing after making a mistake, too. The, uh, expand them. Bro. I messed up ship comps, but it wasn't that bad. And I, my Tomahawk Man fight was a little bad, but I don't think it was two minutes worth of bad. I did not forget how mirrors work, okay? No, my PB definitely did not need to farm a bug frag. I would have reset the run. I guess, honestly, it's because I only hurt twice in the entire split. That's honestly probably it. I know when there's room for improvement, and I know when, um... Wait, what am I taking this fight for? Alright. Alright, so I have to do the fight. Why does Tomahawk only have 300 HP? Because he's like a really good uh, combat navy. I 
That's so unfortunate. Oh wait, I had a drill. I had drill arms. What is wrong with me? What is wrong with me? Good reaction. there's a consistent way to do that fight, but I don't remember it. I haven't practiced. I, I practiced Live 4 a little bit, I will not lie. But I honestly forget all of that practice at this point. Some screen divide here. You still have enough order points? I'm trusting you, Lucky. barely got that. I didn't think about how this fight goes. Okay. I'm gonna move more like here. I don't know if my pixel position matters all that much, but you know what? Sure. Save Shadow Man some damage. Oh no, this actually makes the dark hole harder. I can't force surrounded. Make me throw the run and not bop him? I'd believe it, I'd believe it. Oh wait! Let's go! Uh, I was just saying, I don't actually know if you get enough order points, as you say you do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm trusting you. I have faith. Yeah, no, I know which one you're talking about. Um, how do I handle that? Just trying to remember how to do it. Oh, wait, I know exactly how to do it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I remember how to do it now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you're talking about. Alright, surround me. Give me drill arm. Thank you. Wait, who does what? Shit. Who does what, Darkhold? Who does the one closest to Colonel and Shadow Man right now lurking, if you don't mind me asking? I could've just Jangoed for a guaranteed one turn. Nightman does the one by Colonel. Okay, thank you. Tomahawk. Oh, so I should've already done the Tomahawk Man one instead of swapping. That's right, that's right. Oh yeah, I remember this one. Uh, some weird shit. Oh, I did that way too early! Alright, that's fine. I did that copy damage way too early. Who say for the new War Review coming commentary on Saturday? Relax, dude. Relax. Mm. 
Is there even a guaranteed one turn on this fight? Later. Other than draw anti-fire? <laughs> okay. I, just, I was looking at it and I was like, yeah, I don't think there's a one turn here, but... Yep, cause dive, man. So, the way you do this is like this. I remember this now. I remember how this works. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then you want to. Oh, wait. I forget if this works. Okay, it does. <laughs> I forget if it works on the one that's dope down. Probably could have just double charge shotted, but... Oh no, I'm out of order points. Whatever will I do? I can't believe Lucky lied to me. Colonel <laughs> uh, Warrior, as long as I don't die at the end somehow. You guys are talking two hours into a fucking four hour speedrun. Like, oh man, it's already guaranteed work. Come on, I'm not even at the. I'm, I mean, I basically at the halfway point. But relax! Oh my god, I ruined everything. It's over. Oh wait, why did I break panels? Of course he ends up up there too. Oh no. Yep. I messed up the fight. It's okay-ish. It just means I have to redo the fight. This is what I'm saying! You guys need to relax. I can make mistakes. Let's do this the proper way, shall we? Oh, I went too early on that charge shot. Really? Eh, ah, whatever. Anti water. I'll need to chill. Telling me it's a world record two hours in. Maybe that fight is better with Colonel. Oh, he's definitely gonna PB. Don't get me wrong. That mistake loses the time of a full fight, so it loses like 40 seconds. Gonna mess, mess up Lib 5 and lost 4 minutes on your own? Who knows, man. <gasps> I'm anti-damaging shade, man! Get Destroyed Mega Man.
That was so funny. <laughs> I was assuming, I was expecting him to bust her more, and he just used his shade man on me. Ah <laughs> oh, shit! Where am I? Oh no! Don't read that twice. Oh, anything can happen in the late game. I will be perfectly honest with you. Absolutely anything can happen. I could have to number soul on Cloudman, and that would honestly be the funniest thing. Imagine if I have to do that ever again. Actually, I wonder if I take Buster out, Buster up out at any point. I might. Ah, I don't remember the movement for this area. Team Navi P shots? I know. I definitely don't intentionally keep it in because I think it's good. Don't get me wrong. Oh, shit. I think I at least have attack plus tens in. So I think I could theoretically still number soul. God, that was such a funny run. That run was so dreadful. And then the boss rush just went terribly and everything fell apart, and it was the funniest run I've ever done. Must see food, good luck, be back soon. Alright, small. I will see you when you return. Thanks for the good luck. A bad star code is better than a meh off code. Exactly. Exactly. Varsword isn't meta. Hmm. Hmm. How many usages of Varsword did we see in that run yesterday? <laughs> One? <laughs> I think I legitimately saw one.
That's some way to not use it for 10 seconds. Oh, wait. Uh, one failed run away. I guess we got two, but not too bad. Uh, bad Turn frames! Also, this split... Like, as long as I don't make any dumb mistakes, this is gonna be perhaps my biggest gold yet. I swear. My number man splits have always been really bad. Also, fun little fact I noticed. Uh, we'll, we'll come up on it in a little bit. I'll talk about it then, but... There's something else I learned from watching Lucky's run yesterday. Is it that you have to go into filter comp? Uh, yeah. I, I learned that, but... <laughs> Forgot he made that mistake. Yo, thanks, Dropbox, for telling you're almost full again! <laughs> Sorry about the Windows notification sound. It's that this right here... There's a cutscene that you can skip. I didn't realize that that was a cutscene. Sending you emails nonstop. Time, time to drop it. Expert B and 5 runners can confirm for me that my HP is looking good right now. I I'm pretty sure it looks good from what I can tell. But I just want to make sure, you know. It does good. Totally good. I said BN5 experts chaotic. I would. I didn't even realize. I forgot that the cutscene trigger was there. I was two steps away from the... The, uh... <laughs> the cutscene trigger that would have gotten rid of the fact that I needed... That I got that encounter, right? So, basically, I failed the last possible encounter check just before.
And then, of course, that failed runaway attempt was two fails. 75 and 83.75, or whatever it is. God dang it. Let's make sure that we remember here, by the way. This is very important. Oh, wait. We actually do want to go through it. Good. Lucky talks to the people in here in an interesting way. It's a little different from the order that I do. I don't know which way is faster. This is so hard to mash out. Oh, wait, there's no. Leave me alone, gal! Yeah, he talks- he goes from the top to the bottom, which is really... I should not have done it in this order for the fights, but that's okay. Uh, I'm just gonna pray that they come back before the meteors hit. Nope. Of course not. Of course not. That would be too convenient. My force fights are way worse because my folder is pretty trash. And I'm just executing incorrectly on a lot of these fights. Oh, that is so lucky that I got the full synchro on it. It just saves the charge shot, but that's so funny that it worked out that way. Crack bomb star, wow. Okay, the first two went terribly, then the next four went actually really well, I would say. See some good splits here? Yo, what's up, Jayoku? Indeed, indeed. Looking pretty spicy right now. My title does say it. 
I am getting a sub four today. And I would never lie to you, chat. Can't believe I'm lying. Listen here, chaotic. Oh, shit. I have never lied. I have never lied well in my entire life, okay? We'll put it that way. Sub three. If BN5 ever gets sub three, that'd be fucking insane. Wait, where did I get the 380? Oh yeah. I know. Do I have 75% run rate yet, or am I still at 50? Yeah, 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 I remember now. The fish. The fish! Not killing your own vitals. I was, I was telling my chat yesterday, um, in Among Us, I'm so bad at lying that I have to, I have to tell people exactly what I did and then just make myself not look suspicious through the, my actual actions, despite still managing to get kills. You know what I mean? Like, that's how I have to play it. Yo, what's up, Chris? Classic Chris. There's a few Chris's in here. I'll not lie. Sounds like hard mode. Well, that's the thing. That's the way I have to do it, because I'm so bad at lying. No, yeah, I just basically say, like, partial, partial truths, right? I don't give the full story. But I'm still telling the truth. You just have to find the holes. Look at that! Look at it! Drill arms, dude. Drill arms. You will lie if the truth completely implicates you. Also, yeah, I, I'll lie, but I won't get away with it because I'm bad at it. Everything but still get voted. The unfortunate thing is sometimes you are telling the truth, but the thing is, is that your truth doesn't like, th there's two things that could happen. Your truth isn't enough to make it so that, um, others don't believe, or others believe you fully, because <clears throat> it doesn't 100% clear you, you know what I mean, sometimes. Someone say lying, yo, what's up, boy? Uh, or you just get RDM, and that sucks. That's the thing when the combo poster kills someone, they get voted. Yeah, I hate when I get voted for someone else. Even though, like, I never saw the body, right? Like, I just happened to be in the area, and it's like, oh, you're sus. It's great. I love it. It's like, I didn't see the body. I didn't know that my code buster even killed there. Uh, unfortunately, chat. I have to look away for a bit. Oh, this one. While I do this, I don't want to lose a run to 100 man challenge. Okay, we got it. 
dumb transition. Love the DS groaning in this second. <laughs> I didn't even know about that. What the heck? I actually rarely get voted when you're not imposter. Which makes it hardest imposter because of everyone. Yeah, I try and play in a way that sometimes is really suspicious. W even when I'm crewmate, just to help my imposter gameplay. It's also kind of what Chaotic does, although Chaotic's just naturally suspicious. Uh, Chaotic doesn't do things like, you know... He doesn't do the... Sabotages at all, he just does his tasks, right? He doesn't give a fuck what... If we die, he just wants to do his tasks. He wants to be a good boy, you know? You keep fucking up as imposter on Polis and killing at the same wrong spot. Where? Didn't I unplug for Axio? What's up, Supersonic? Everyone keeps telling me this is Whirr, and we're still... <sighs> we're still so far from done. Come on, guys. Let's relax a, a little bit. People died, but we went on tasks. You were justified. This is correct. Oh, yeah. This bad movement. Oh, wait. How do I do this? Fixed. <laughs> Saying it jokingly, of course. True, true. O2, where the cameras can see. There's a camera there? Where the heck is that camera? by the garbage. Oh, I forgot where it was. There we go. So I think you never saw a game end by sabotage. I've seen one or two. Uh, unfortunately, I have to actually kind of focus on this so I can't keep up with chat all the time. I don't want to make a dumb mistake in Gargoyle comps. Just be happy if the run finishes, that means we get factory comp music. True. But what? I, my HP's good, right? Like, I'm not going crazy, am I? not even, therefore it's bad. Shut it, it's even? What do you mean? Look at it. 418's an even number. Uh, I'm still not going to do the lucky or luckies strat here. I'm just going to do what I'm used to. Because I want to time this at some point. We also have a friend who loves being on security all the maps. Next game we play him an event in security. <laughs> You're learning. If only you've ever seen me play imposter. That's that's my gameplay in a nutshell. Hanging around to vent into security and kill them. Doesn't holding the run button with auto run equipped make you run faster? No. Yep. You don't run any faster. Oh, I forgot. I keep forgetting that. You lose a frame every time you press B. Oh, interesting. That I did not know. I assume it's because it's trying to change the animation still. Or some weird shit.
That stunned you thought I meant you just went a bit faster. Good thing Fat Kid knows things about this game that I don't. Is that the Fat Kid? No. I must refuse. Is that the best imposter in Among Us? Lil underscore Fat Kid? Uh, I do like Lucky Strat here somewhere. I don't remember what it was though. So I'm gonna continue to do the strats that I know work. Kid's a good partner. Dude, Kid is the best solo imposter I swear I've ever seen. The number of times that he and I have been imposter together and it ends up being him solo and he wins still is crazy. Like, maybe it's just because I put enough suspicion on myself that Fat Kid never gets suspected or I swear to god, Fat Kid's just the greatest solo imposter I've ever met. I'm curious what Fat Kid's, uh... Oh no, what did I just do? Hold on, I forgot to go grab the last one. Here we go. Uh, wait. Oh, I ruined it, cool. Let's see what I can do here. All right. I messed up Gargoyle comps. Let's go. What are these failed runaways, dude? These have actually been atrocious. If we saw Fat Kid's solo imposter feat, <laughs> that shit was crazy. I think this goes in for like a buster up or something. And I rigged that. Dude, my folder edits today have not been good. Oh wait, why did I pause? <laughs> I was supposed to press A. I don't trust that. The first one should have been free, but that's... That was still... God. That's what was so bad, and look at that freaking gold. Fat Kid can myrtle to three people back to back and no one even notices any of them. The funny thing about that is, he did that while Terra was alive still. Of all people, he did that while Terra was still alive, and he never killed Terra. And he still got away with it. Yeah, I messed up Gargoyle comps. I had like every failed runaway imaginable in that split, and I still saved time on lurking. What the fuck is this run right now? I did have some pretty good forest fights though. Like I'm sure that I only f messed up two of them really, and the others were pretty fast. Your emulator must have been running at like 57 FPS. <laughs> I'm 
missed a turn frame. Or wasted a turn frame, I should say. It's the time save from not going to pick up Bar Sword. There we go. Look at that. Uh, so I need to swap back to copy damage rig. <sighs> Unfortunately, I still want to keep Dark Drill on the top slots. Despite the fact that it's a bad draw on everyone else. This is my least favorite part of the Liberations. I honestly hate this opening for Colonel. But you need those order points. It's so... Ugh. In fact, you take two hours doing folder edits. That would, you know. Can I get this off? I guess I can if I just do that. Oh, that was bad. How much damage does my trick shot do at this point? Oh, you get a counter hit. Unfortunately, there's like no really good draw that makes this one turn any faster. Did I paralyze Nightman? Ah, uh, Nightman. I will be paralyzing Nightman. It saves. It like loses a bit of time. Um, because you have to pass. Or not pass. Uh, you have to swap one more time, but. I think Mega Man for the Dark Hole is just better. Oops. <laughs> Buster Bug. I'm also still light Mega Man, by the way. <laughs> Good number man split? Indeed. Indeed. I nailed it, everything. The only thing was just some bad RNG with encounters. And I guess I messed up Gargoyle comps a tiny bit, but it wasn't the end of the world. The Nightman changed to Paralyzing Mega. That was after your PB. I see. I see. Uh, it doesn't really make a huge difference. I don't know how to properly swap to save turn frames in this liberation, by the way. I'm gonna try and get one of them to move forward. It did not happen. Oh, what the hell? That worked out beautifully. Oh, wait, we got this one. Tomahawk Man's sick. Friendly reminder, he's the MVP. The in five, the true MC. Well, Nightman's the MVP. Uh, Tomahawk Man's just the MC. I forgot. That, that's how it goes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Do 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 do. Yeah, this fight really sucks with Mega Man. Uh, that's like, that's the worst that that fight can go. If you just like assume a no draw, I would say.
Hey, what's up, bro? Nice controller display I got there. Yo, thanks. Uh, who does this dark hole lurking, if you don't mind me asking? Is it Tomahawk Man? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I would have gone with. Yeah, 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 now I remember. Because, fun fact, I do have a little bit of practice on this. And I know when the proper time to swap from Nightman is. Yeah, 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 yeah. Copy damage. Swing. Yep, I remember this fight. Wait, just a tiny bit. And then... Beautiful. Simply magnificent. Mega Man couldn't do his job yet because we need the order points here first. Good thing I remembered. Yes, I did remember to do Number Man first. It's a miracle. Swords are in case something happened. Uh, this isn't quite the ninja fight yet. Custom points. Yeah. Oh, it's this fight. I remember this one. So it's like... Necessary. Make sure you don't miss a sword. <laughs> So, I forget if it's absolutely required to screen divide. It's probably optimal to do it. But just one turn anyway. There is no reason not to. Except menuing. <laughs> yeah, it slaves a down input in a couple text boxes. <laughs> Just in case. Nope. Swag. Friendly reminder, that's my strat. Even before I ran BN5, I came up with that strat. Moving Number Man over just in case, I might still get to pass with him. <sighs> it's a one turn, okay? Don't talk about it. <laughs> God, that was so bad. <laughs> it was lucky that it was a two virus fight, honestly, with that draw. That draw was so bad. I legit don't remember the correct way to do this. <laughs> I think that's correct. <laughs> Yeah. 
All right, Tomahawk Man, get over there. <laughs> the last 61 gamer. Heck yeah. <laughs> All right, fuck number man. Get in there, Mega Man. Be the dark Mega you were destined to be. I accidentally let go of it. Oh, hey. I'm gonna take this hit and then... Look at that! Look at that, dude! Fucking killing it right now. How dare I go to the split? <laughs> I'm gonna trust, I didn't time it yet, I'm gonna trust that jacking in at Scylab HP is slower. That will be the strat for Nebula Gray, 100%. You are correct, Sai. Ah, <laughs> I didn't turn fast enough. No. Fun fact, you can't cut out a horizontal movement there. If you, you can cut out a horizontal movement there and you avoid the cutscene trigger. It is the dumbest thing I've ever seen. Sequence break time. Oh, look at that move. Do -do 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 Oh. My movement was so good there, I actually instinctively started to correct myself because I thought I went too fast on that corner. Uh, so I need to sneak around it and then I need to read an email. Sick turn frames. <laughs> Drill four, you missed this place. Just noticed all the golds? Indeed. Indeed. 
I've been playing out of my mind, honestly, and getting pretty good RNG. Um, it's either... It's the classic... Oops. One split is either I messed up but got good RNG, or I played perfectly and got, you know, a little bit of bad RNG. Oh, hi. You're a draw. How many charge shots can you get off during Django? Probably like four or five. You might be faster to just copy damage charge shot. Of course you're in the way. Alright. Stupid orange shirt kid. Dolphin skip. <laughs> oh, look at that. My movement is phenomenal right now. Alright, how are these three fights gonna go? I am totally getting off. I was gonna say, I'm gonna get Buster bugged, but not like that. I could have just gone for the charge shot. But I was hoping that I was just gonna get one pellet and it was gonna be the charge damage. Um. <laughs> the left comparison is Lurking's Colonel World Record. I don't know how this stands up against uh, Lucky's <laughs> Lucky's PB right now. It's honestly probably pretty close to it. If I had to take a wild guess. Because you have to think that it's eight minutes ahead of. Lurkings, so. Oh. <laughs> but yeah. Uh, okay. Oh, man. 
Yeah, I've also just been too lazy to update my splits to include Lucky's new war since he got it. Trying to do that fight is so hard. I think Cosmo Man Split is one hit of Lucky, but I don't know what version should save time. Uh, I forget how Lib 6 goes. His Medi fight is honestly probably not that bad. I forgot that <laughs> I was swapping back to land, so I needed to hold B to run. Lib 6 should be relatively comparable simply because I have a more consistent Dark Colonel strat, but I might also mess it up. Still. I still don't understand how the magnet panels work. Nope, me neither. <laughs> Seemingly random. Alright, okay, excuse me. Not random, just different every time. Like his game wasn't great, except for Nebula Great that had the perfect draw that he messed up. Oh yeah, it was still a turn one dark chip, which is still going to be fast. Alright. Wait, so you're saying he gets to the undernet at that time? Almost exactly one minute ahead? Cool. <laughs> Mega Man's sprite comes to the front. <laughs> Just for that. I never noticed that. I'm also gonna save some time by not picking up Neovari. Cloudman and Lib4. This is correct. All of these things are accurate. God. <laughs> that Lib4 thing was so bad. <laughs> I guess he doesn't have to pick this up. Oh wait. Sneaker on muscle memory was way too strong there. Are you kidding me? 
I don't know if this is worthwhile. Okay. I guess it was. Number man passes. Yeah. You guys ready to see Number Man be a hero later? Turn two. No, it's turn three. These are the JP strats that I have adjusted. It was either that or I have to wait around a bunch for reasons. Oh wait, this is Shadow Man. I thought I was using Tomahawk Man. Because normally I get that fight with Tomahawk Man. I don't know why. It's just. Fire is like slot five with copy damage in slot four, so yes. No, I've not checked your strap for that dark hole. Uh, I don't know why I'm passing here, but whatever. Inconsistent based on enemy movements, but pretty simple and you can get it one turn. I see. Uh, Alright. <laughs> Let's go, Tomahawk Man. I didn't take damage. That's what that's what really matters. fine on health too. Doesn't matter because he's not the one that's gonna do the boss fight. I just need to keep Shadow Man healthy. Not even. I need to keep Tomahawk Man healthy. Even though he's not even gonna do the boss fight. You have to take damage from the brute. Yeah, yeah. I can imagine how that goes with Tomahawk Man. I think I've done it with Tomahawk Man in the past. Tomahawk Man has 
I guess two more jobs, actually. Number Man has one job coming up soon. Are you are you guys ready? Yep. Man has two more fights that he has to get through that are completely random. And now it's time for Number Man's one and only job. Do not one turn this guy. He did it! Let's go! <laughs> Number man, the true hero. The hero we don't deserve. True. Absolutely true. Uh... Ah yes, perfect. You hit the one person I wanted you to hit. Alright, Shadow Man. Serve no purpose right now. Go get healthy again. Alright, Tomahawk Man, go and do your job. Technically speaking, I could do the Dark Hole with, num with Shadow Man, but it's not, honestly not that much better. Oh god. Thank god I drew a drill arm. There's a consistent way that Lucky has taught me that I don't remember that you can do. Uh, on that fight <clears throat> with just copy damage and Tomahawk Man's charge shot but I don't remember it at all does copy damage or does anti-fire hit this guy properly did I learn? yes Number man, you no longer have any real purpose, but at least number check's good. Alright, let's make sure we don't accidentally do this fight with Toad Man. Pogren. Indeed. Indeed. Um, okay. Let's see what we can do here. Move next turn and block me? Block who? Shadow Man? Tomahawk Man's already gonna be there. Tomahawk Man's my backup for when Shadow Man doesn't work, and Shadow Man can get there, so. Screw you. Okay. 
I was supposed to put Toad Man in a slightly different position. Um, because Toad Man, I think, is on the wrong panel right now, but... I was also supposed to pass with Number Man right away. That was bad, but whatever. Eh. I could have copy damage Tomahawk Swinged, but... At this point, I just want to... <laughs> At this point, I don't want to think. <laughs> I also don't want to accidentally die. Even though you have Undershirt, but it would have been on a Poison panel, so it's like... Risky. I could have technically put Number Man in position to avoid this, but yeah. Shadow Man is the one who does the fight. Tomahawk Man's already there, Mega Man's already there, so like... There's actually no way that I have to do this fight with Toad Man or Number Man. Especially not with the way I do this with Shadow Man. That's fine. Impressive. Let me know if I don't want these updates. I'll let you know. Uh, okay, so reverse ID. We want that swapped, and we want Shade Man out. Actually, yeah, you know what? We'll swap this one in. And we want very grab legged. Let me do this. Now because did it. Or we remove everything. Uh, auto run goes in first. Oh wait, first we have to do that. Attack plus one goes in. So let's plus one. Charge plus one. fail every runaway imaginable. I thought I was leaving Higsby's. Yeah, you're definitely getting factory comps this run. 100%. Unless I somehow die to Tomahawk Man. Tomahawk Man is like the only one I can maybe die to in the team rush, and I don't even think that's possible. I would go for it, but I'm not risking it. Keep in mind. 
karma good. I like it. It's actually not even that bad a movement. Hashtag team ratio, it's a culture. Really no point. Um, oh, okay. Swing. My PB is US. It was like my w first US run that I got going. And it's the, actually the only US run I've ever gotten going, besides this one. So, so no, it's not just free time save. Casual 20 minute PB incoming? Maybe, maybe. We don't talk about it, okay? <laughs> We're compared to a run with Guardian. But you have to realize, Solar King. I was gonna say, there's still golds against my guardian golds. The only one I think that is my gold is still on JP is probably Lib 4. What caused all the golds? I got good at the game, finally. That's pretty much all it is. Like. Uh, I'm combining all of my knowledge, along with the world record analysis, everything I gathered from that, and that this run is the culmination of everything. <laughs> oh shit. I couldn't tolerate how bad I was before. Yep, there it is. <laughs> I have ascended. Yeah, I know. Alright. There we go. I also did start having fun. This was correct. Imagine a BN run where I'm having fun. I was tilted at this point. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, what's up? Alright. Which version is the fastest? There we go. Oh, I had it. I had it again. There we go. Okay, one more. What are you, little shit? You absolute little shit. There we go. Do, 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 do. Right, the only fight there that was slow was maybe no it was just shadow man shadow man's the only one i would say was slow how does he keep doing it very carefully very carefully insert me making a comment about dark white shut up <laughs> pause buffering 
<laughs> Don't worry about it. Against Shadow Man, I absolutely have to. Wait. Why'd I go this way? Okay. We're, in, we're losing time here because I'm dumb. But whatever. I was too focused on the fact that I just golded. I had to make some mistake for the next run. Alright. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's probably a minute of time loss. Or more. God damn it, get out of my way, you nerd. But yeah, I was too busy thinking about how good everything was that I completely... I was thinking about it when I was going up. I was like, please remember to jack in at the right spot. And then it just slipped my mind. Whatever. 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 No, it wouldn't have been better to just jack out because the thing is I was supposed to jack in from the top of the um, the castle into like the samurai guy who's just sitting up there. So like it would not have been worth to go back up unless I realized way earlier. The only thing maybe I could have done better at that point is go jack in from males. Oh wait, no, 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 I don't need the HP memory, what am I doing? Do, 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 do. I normally get the HP memory here, actually, because the reason I did that was because it meant another potential encounter, which would have helped him with my karma. I actually have no idea how my karma looks. I could throw the run. Yeah, I know. Like, this was just a huge mistake, honestly. Ah, oh, shit, this way. I might get an encounter check now. I have to leave last some room for improvement, you know what I mean? I don't want it to be, like, that good. Yeah, I got an extra encounter because I got one encounter because of Uh yeah, I definitely did two unisons in Team Rush. Shadow Man Nightman. Uh sorry. No. Almost perfect. Yeah, extra encounter from that mistake. True. Proving my karma. God the amount of walking. It wouldn't have been as much if I had done the right thing, but yeah. Okay, here we go. Yeah, no failed runaways. Always a nice feeling. RNG manip. <laughs> When you had to go all the way up, not side lab four. Oh, don't worry, I way ahead of you there, lurking. <laughs> 
Ooh, no encounter. Oh no, dude. This this game would have been the one that yeah, I could totally see that happening. All right, factory comps time. Because I won't do pipe comp. Wow, look at that. Look at that. Look at how much HP. Oh, you can't see it right now, but... I have, like, so much HP right now because I have not used that many dark chips. And I'm actually chaos unison a few times, even. How's the run so far? Hmm. Hmm. Should look on the right side of the stream. We'll see a color in a lot of places that indicates good things. Yellow means slow, right? Yeah, it means to go slow. Exactly. I don't have a right side, only a bad side. Toxic! See, piss yellow. Oh, wait. I'm not gonna talk about that. I pressed the wrong button because I was thinking liberations. Whatever. People change their colors, how am I to know what's good? Turn frames. Ruined. Final transmission from three. Both definitely very good. You're not wrong. Right, I'm literally at 474. I can't even drop below the necessary amount. Oh yeah, most final comps are fantastic, for sure. Almost always one of, if not the best songs in their respective games. BN2 is an exception because, uh, you have, <laughs> uh, you still have. Oops. What's it called? And you will know the truth. Splendid. There we go. BN1, I don't even remember the final comps. Only has one final comp. <laughs> uh, do I get another encounter? It's Mega Man. Would you count the Star Force music? I mean, I would count it. Um. can't even do the fights. Alright, float shoot. Alright, 
So that's three in that gun. Right, what's up, Blizzard Man? How are we doing today? Understandable. Have a nice day. Searching with navvies. It was like you and your partner are actually fighting their way forward despite the odds. Do I want a lucky comparison update? I mean, feel free to. You can update the class. I'm honestly not even feeling nervous right now. 320 ahead. Solid, solid. Get 420 head? I'll try my hardest. I will try my hardest. I make no promises though. Just worried about Shade Man. I mean, I'm saving time on Lucky to Shade Man just because, guess what? I ain't pausing, bitch. Or I ain't saving, I should say. That's what I meant. Hmm. Shadow Man, just throw the runway, don't you? Isn't gotcha hell? <laughs> Is 348. Yeah. Makes sense. Well, yeah, because we took a break, but the timer kept going. The, the point of the were analysis is that we're supposed to be able to pause the run and talk about stuff. So we don't normally, like the goal and the actual timer are not going to be lined up with the actual run. All right, what's up Shade Man? You know, throw my run in the garbage bin. I'm down. Let's do it. Fuck it. Lucky hasn't submitted yet, too. That's correct. That's correct. Uh, 
Never seen that red status for Mega Man? That's anger. Uh, it usually happens if you get paralyzed for too long. Angry. For you lurking, we're going to we're going to rock R N Jesus, okay? Are you ready? Are you all ready? Who is ready for Arn Jesus to take the wheel? And you see, yeah, also big damage like that does also cause anger. Youch! Oh wait, this way. <laughs> Alright, Dingo. Take the wheel. <laughs> I knew I was gonna get an encounter right away. <laughs> oh wait, keep going that way. My movement is less than optimal here. As long as you hold the tomahawk to the sky while you run. True. Uh, this is actually a good time on that encounter. I think this means that Dingo is likely to get an encounter. Tomahawk man is likely to get an encounter right near the end. Use humor bug though? I mean, I am emotion bugged, so. It's not with humor, but it's emotion bug. <laughs> uh, that's unfortunate! Alright, Higsby. Let's see you run away with your 50% encounter. <laughs> Let's go, baby. Youch! I not mean to throw that, but okay. Youch! Blinder! Oh god. Oh god. What is happening? I have no clue what is happening right now. Always punished. My god, I'm the luckiest man in the world. Oh my god. <laughs> I went in with full synchro instead of ex <laughs> God damn it. Never punished, by the way. 
Just to make sure we don't go dark. True. God, that was the luckiest draw of my life. Alright. Get in there, Colonel. Can't you believe you were here when BN5 fucking died? Eh, I mean, this run still has a bunch of mistakes, so... I wouldn't say it's dead. Oh, why did you attack you? Oh no. Oh no. I wanted to get rid of the fan. Oh god. Wait, which? There it is. Don't get deleted. True. Uh, Never underestimate a render to die to the dumbest shit. This is correct. I can still die to Nebula Gray. It's not out of the question. Uh, that's the wrong way. But, you yeah. know. <sighs> Proto next? I am not planning on playing Proto. I would not say that Colonel is dead, but... Why, why did I wave dash after the fight with floppy.exe? I don't know what you mean by wave dash. Wave dash is definitely something in melee, I just don't know how it translates here. Just get lucky. Just get lucky! Oh. I was dash dancing. That's probably a better term to use. Urk. Wow, I got baited. Wow! Look at the moves on this guy! I totally understood what you meant by froppy.exe. <laughs> While you make this sandwich, I will try my hardest chaotic. Who will spend money to get many? <laughs> the last probable encounter. swap back to Mega Man. There we go. Now we can do what I was trying to do. Alright, Cosmo Man. We are definitely not going dark today. Hog Champ.
Cosmo Man destroyed. Everything in this game is so long, true. He didn't make it. <laughs> Get word for him. I'll try. I'll try, boys. For our men. The, the Green Navy. Yeah, I was gonna say, this isn't sub-345. But, it's probably a 345 time, maybe. Save, you cunt? Bro, what? What's a save? Is that where you, like, almost throw the run, but you, you know, actually just get good, and suddenly the run is saved? Can't believe you have to listen to Rish say gun anymore. Ah, <laughs> oh, come on! Last encounter check. <laughs> Ruined! Ruined! <laughs> hmm. Eh, I didn't need to take anything else, but whatever. Let's go, baby. <laughs> Still got the 345XX. Jesus Christ. I have never seen my chat go that fast before. Thank you all for the GGs. <laughs> Holy shit, people are right for being five. How can you save 56 seconds? Oh, plenty of places. <laughs> you can save it in that last split alone. Never seen a 350, and I never will. You're right. You're right. You were like 80% sure I was gonna die to Nebula Grey. I could easily probably, yeah. So, alright, let's go quickly go over this run, right? Early game, there's still some time safe, but overall, still a pretty good time. Blizzard Man, I literally failed the Blizzard Man fight. I legitimately failed the Blizzard Man fight, lost 45 seconds there. Easily, right? There alone. Nightman Split, still made some mistakes in drill comps, but overall, uh, it was okay. Not too bad. Shade Man Split, beautiful. Live 2 just went phenomenally. Shadow Man Split can probably still be improved. I was like desperate for Zenny. Uh, so, like, just a good run with good Zenny, good bug frags will probably still save time there. Cloudman. I messed up the Cloudman fight and ended up having to do it with Nightman, which was probably a mistake, but just finished the fight with Shadowman. Tomahawkman split was good. A lot of failed runaways, I think? No, it was a not, not a lot of failed runaways, some bad movement in ship comps. Lib4 literally messed up a fight with Nightman and had to redo it. Lost like 40 seconds there. Not really. Like, um, 
Number man split, phenomenal. A lot of failed runaways, but my execution, kind of flawless. There was only two bad force fights in there, but they were still like, okay. Um, all the other force fights were fantastic. <clears throat> Did the downgrade from Blissman SP to normal chip ever waste any more time? Not really, actually. I don't think there was ever a time that it became a problem. Cosmo Man Split. That liberation went beautifully. Not much else to say. <laughs> uh, Toad Man. I actually did that split perfectly. Um, I don't think there's any improvement there. Lib 6. I did not get the perfect Dark Kernel strat, but it worked really well. Uh, overall, that liberation was really good. Team Rush. Uh, only really messed up the Shadow Man fight. Nebula Gray. I lost a minute alone. <clears throat> to jacking in from the wrong spot right after the team rush split like lost at least a minute there right so overall i would say there's at least two three more minutes of time save of reasonable time save it was about a minute exactly yeah am i the jagoomba of bn5 maybe maybe so what's up Tara? Uh, smug. What happened to PB by 19 minutes? I literally just got good at the game. The world record analysis yesterday actually taught me a few minor optimizations I can make, but I finished doing my save states, which also gave me a chance to practice some of the US strats as well. BN5 War Review next Saturday. Give me good luck during Star Force 2. This is because of you. True, true. Go up front, baby. To be fair, I also kept asking Lurking, like, who am I supposed to you do this uh, Dark Hole fight with over and over again? <laughs> so Lurking helped out quite a bit. Should have lied. <laughs> toxic, toxic.